Forecast has said an absolute maximum of 43C is possible amid a 95% likelihood the all-time record will fall. BBC weather Simon King said the UK's record of 38.7C is now expected to be broken just after lunchtime, adding there will be still be a couple of hours of beating after the to potentially exceed the the 40 C staggering. The Met Office also confirmed that last night was the warmest night on record in Britain, with temperatures not falling below 25 C in many areas of England and Wales. The highest overnight minimum in in the UK last night was 25.9 C at Emily Mall in West Yorkshire, while it was 25.8 C at Kinley in Croydon, South London. This smashed the previous record of 23.9 C in Brighton set on August 3rd, 1990. It comes one day after Wales had its hottest day ever with 37.1 C in How in Howarden, Frenchshire, beating a record set in the same village in 1990. The mercury peaked in the UK at 38.1 C in Suffolk yesterday, making it the hottest day of 2022 and the third hottest on record after 38.7 C in Cambridge in July 2019 and 38.5 C in Kent in August 2003. Network rail and train operators upgraded their travel advice for services heading north out of London into the red warning area to do not travel, saying there will be no services in or out of London King's Cross all day today. The heat has brought major rail chores for commuters around the capital with no Thameslink or Great Northern trains running in any location north of London from, Bra from Blackfriars via St. Pancras or from King's Cross or Mulgate. Transport Secretary Grant Sharps told people across Britain today to apply common sense and depending on the nature of your journey and reason for it, you might want to consider rearranging your day around it. But the sight of, pa the sight of parts of the UK shutting down sparked a backlash with complaints that ministers and health chiefs were acting like nanny world holiday makers were delayed yesterday as part of runaway at Lanton Airport melted. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.